Pero tiene rango 3 él también. Agonía, rango 1-3. <coughs> Anet, eres absurda. Puedes ponerte aquí y darle al acorazado. ¡Guay! No deberías poder hacer eso. El nivel... Por un momento creía que era el nivel de hachas de Anet. Me había creído. Anet ha subido hachas. ¿What? Yoink. Au. Yoink. Kill. Ser healer puro en este juego no es bueno. Mercedes no aporta utilidad. Dentro de los problemas que tiene Flame, Flame aunque sea tiene rescatar. <coughs> Aduken. Yoink. Mejor que tenga esos hits, por si acaso. Ah, van al norte. No huyáis de mí, cobardes. <risa> oh Dios santo. Se la pueden cargar a la vez y otra vez, eh. Uh, los están envenenando todos. Tranquila bestia, yo te salvaré y luego me quedaré tu drop que no podré forjar. ¡Houtecle! ¡Oh! ¡Quiero la Houtecler! Sabéis que soy muy fan de las alas blancas. ¡Quiero la Houtecler! ¡Petra será Minerva! Espera que no tenga el, los materiales para forjarlo. Mercedes level up. HP, defensa. Yo sí que lo sé. Ha pasado lo que siempre te pasa. Lo de siempre. No ha ocurrido nada nuevo. Eso no es ni sorprendente, ni nuevo, ni fuera del ordinario. En realidad, fuera del ordinario sí que es porque no deberías tener esos, esa magia de mierda que tienes. Pero bueno... Quiero esa... Les voy a snipear la Houtecler en función de cómo dejan al bicho este. Ahí, venida por mí. Nope. Nope. Prepare yourself. Se van a cargar la armadura por completo. Se han cargado la armadura por completo. Aliento ponzoñoso. Oh Dios santo. Me ha salido bien fuerte el CC con ponzoñoso. Otra vez ponzoñoso. 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 Yes. Sé que tengo tendencia... Tenden ya no sé hablar hoy. Ya no puedo hablar. <risa> Siempre he tenido tendencia al ceceo, pero decir ponzoñoso es un poco ridículo ya. Incluso para mí.
Really, Felix? Really, Felix? Ah. Veis por mí, solo ve. ¡Ah! Yo quería snipear y marcharme. Bueno, marcharme no, no, no que pueda marcharme realmente. Ah, bueno, siempre puede haber un crítico de 1%, de 11%. Eh, no importa. Fortify, porque why not? No he fortificado. Ah, ahí está, Dimitri. Y con el emblema se ha hecho más fuerte. Pero bueno, ¿qué más hará? Es decir, fortificar no me parece un hechizo especialmente útil en este juego. Porque por lo general no vas a tener a mucha gente herida. Como el juego es fácil, ser healer no aporta demasiado. Salvo que tengas cosas como War por rescate, claro. Bueno, eh, hemos de matarlo nosotros, ¿eh? Oh, wow, sí que tiene vida. Uno menos. ¿What? ¿Ha doblado? ¡Wow! wow ¿Cómo? Bueno, en fin. A ver. Que me voy a robar la Houtecler. Espero que no te importe. Pues no puedo así sin más, tiene demasiado HP. Pero todo tiene solución, por supuesto. Yoink. Ouch. Yoink. Yeah. Oh, Au. Hadouken. Obtienes a Houtecler. Tengo que repararla primero. Y con esto hemos terminado. Seis mil novecientos de oro. Hacer de Woods. Fase superada, MVP. Anet, qué sorpresa. Qué sorpresa que quien básicamente se ha tenido que solear el lado derecho haya sido la MVP, a pesar de que tenía tres compañeros expuestos. ¿Cómo se nota que Águilas Negras es la ruta más popular? <coughs> y aún así, le siete aparece ahí abajo. Es el cumpleaños de Mercedes. Eh, mira, ni flores. Estoy muy decepcionado contigo, Mercedes. Eres mi gran decepción. Ya decía que esto tenía que ocurrir sí o sí. Hagamos los apoyos y lo dejaremos por ahora. I have a question for you. Answer quickly before my hand slips and I cut you in half. Always so ominous. Well, what is it, Felix? Sometimes you have an animal's face, contorted with anger and bloodlust. At other times a man's with a friendly smile. Which is your true face? 
ambas. Eso es bastante sencillo. No creo que Dimitri esté justificando nada. Puede que vivir por ellos sea un sin sentido, pero la gente puede vivir por los muertos, Félix. You have to respect that boundary. If you keep stringing gravestones around your neck, you'll snap. Even still, I cannot forget them, nor can I let them go. Then keep those thoughts to yourself. If you're too weak to do that, abandon your throne. Become a gravekeeper. Felix. I'm not immune to emotion, you know. Far from it. I haven't gone a day without questioning why my father and brother had to die while I survived. I'll bear this pain until the day I die, but I refuse to wallow in it. I have more important things to do than blubber for my whole life. <laughs> you know, Felix, you really are growing more and more like your brother. Always so sarcastic and constantly looking for a fight. But deep inside, more than anyone, you... What are you getting at? Oh, it's nothing. But allow me to thank you. Your perspective has opened my eyes. <laughs> Not my intention. I couldn't stand the pathetic look on your face, that's all. I see. If you say so, then we will leave it at that. El el apoyo entre Dimitri Flex VA. Dudu con Mercedes. Oh, Dudu. Are you praying to the goddess of Bloodline? That seems odd. Won't the Dusker gods be upset if they hear you praying to another land's deity? The Fodland goddess was recognized in Dusker too. The deities of foreigners are seen as the protectors of their respective lands. It has been said that we would offer our prayers to her in times of war. Huh. So the goddess is part of a pantheon. I guess that's one way to interpret it. Anyway, what are you praying for? For peace to come even one day sooner. <sighs> that's a lovely prayer. I was just thinking about praying for that myself. I see. Hey, Dudu, what are your plans for yourself once this war is finally over? To serve his highness for the rest of my days. I thought you might say that. And you? That's a good question. I was thinking about traveling to Dusker. To Dusker? There is nothing of interest left there. Isn't it where you were born? And isn't it where your wonderful food and stories come from? I think those are reasons enough to visit at least once. Mercedes. If you will allow it, I would like to accompany you. His Highness would surely grant me leave to go. You really think so? Then I hope the war ends as soon as possible. As do I. We're going to have to shower the goddess with prayers. We'll pray that she watches over and protects us while we work to end this war. Then, when it's finally finished, we can travel. That promises to be interesting. We should pray to the Dusker gods as well. Yes, 
That's a brilliant idea. Which of the Dusker gods should we pray to? For victory, we pray to the god of war. Or... Or... Just the god of war. Come on! <laughs> what were you going to say? Uh. Oh, I know. It's the god of travel, right? Let us leave it at that. I knew I was right. You taught me so much about your gods. So let's pray. For the end of the war, and for our safe travels to Dusker. Eso ha sido bonito. El nivel de apoyo entre de Mercedes se veo. Ah, hello. To do, yes? Finished praying? I am, yes. You have grown much since I saw you last. You're a man now. You barely know me. True. I suppose we did only meet a handful of times. As haggard as you look now, you were even worse when I last saw you in the capital. Haggard, eh? True enough. Still weighed down by the same regret, I see. I was unable to protect the king. That is the ultimate failure. One I must atone for. If you have the spare time to beg forgiveness, then pick up a lance and train. That would do nothing to atone for the dead. Your prayers are mere self-indulgence. You do not understand. No, I do not. Fargus needed you. His Highness needed you. There was no other choice but for me to leave. What would you have done if you were in my place? If his highness had died due to your failures? If he commanded me to live, then I would live. Otherwise, I would die with him. I have nothing left to lose other than his highness. Home, family, all but that man I have already lost. You were a knight in service to the king for decades. Not only did you excel in bravery, wisdom, and tactics, but in matters of character, you were an ideal knight, utterly above reproach. That is what His Highness has always said. I have only come this far by modeling my conduct after his stories of you. But now... Forget those words spoken by His Highness. I am no different a man than I was before. Beaten down by sin, alone and weak, I am lost and irredeemable. Uf. <coughs> Felix, el último con Anet. <sighs> Now the flowers are all taken care of. Huh? Felix, why are you hiding there? I'm not hiding. No? Then what are you here for? You don't even have a real reason, do you? No, I don't. Then why? Because of you. What? What's that supposed to mean? I want you to sing for me. I hear your voice when I'm asleep or in battle. <laughs> it's like... It's like I'm your captive. My captive? What are you saying? Oh my, I'm suddenly really flustered. I can't help it. Uh, I don't know what I'm saying. Forget I said anything. Felix, are you blushing? Felix, tienes un gusto impecable. I don't know. Shut up. I'm not blushing. You feel like that about it? I suppose I could sing for you sometimes, if you like that sort of thing. Oh? I'd better go. Bye. Hey, wait! You just got here. Do you want to hear me sing or not? <laughs> uh, yes, I, I do. 
Well, what song do you want me to sing? Bears, Swamp Beasties, Foxes, or Dungeon? I'd like to hear all of them, if you don't mind. Starting with the library song in full. Sing for me, please, Annette. Well, okay, just this once. Félix, tienes un gusto impecable. El nivel la puede entrar Félix en el subida plus. Silven, llevamos muchas batallas, llevamos muchas batallas en mi lugar también, tío. No subes, ah, qué carajos estás haciendo. Flame. Silvain. Hi. Why do you look so down? But hey, if you're talking to me of your own accord, can I assume you've figured out I'm not a monster? I wanted to apologize about my treatment of you earlier, Sylvain. I am not normally one to put stock in such rumors. Nothing to be upset about. I mean, I've kind of earned that reputation. I've just... I've got this sickness. When I see a pretty girl, I can't stop myself from flirting with her. Ah, pero luego oh, las chicas solo me quieren por mi emblema. Like you, for instance. Oh, I am so sorry to hear of your illness. Perhaps my magic will help heal you. Huh? No, I didn't mean it like that. No? Are you not ill then? You know what? Let's just... Let's move on. Can I take this to mean everything is good between us? Of course. Sylvain, I look forward to getting to know you without the falsity of rumors. Great. Would you like to celebrate our new friendship by joining me for a meal? You would treat me to a feast? <laughs> That is very kind of you. A chance to spend time with a sweet girl like yourself? It's a pleasure. Your voice like birdsong. Your eyes clear as diamonds. But I'm drawn to your kind and loving heart. I am a captive to your charms, Flane. I hear that very frequently. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I... I guess a girl as cute as you would get a lot of compliments. Anyway, what type of meal were you considering, Sylvain? I would love some seafood followed by a delicious cake. Por supuesto que la diosa del pescado le apetece comer pescado. I am absolutely famished as I often am. Shall we be on our way? <laughs> She's a tough one. Sheltered girls like her usually fall for that kind of stuff. But she's much too savvy, even for a smooth talker like myself. Y... Oh, se tiene... ¡Ah, van a estar plus! Praying, father? Yes. Praying is all I can do. For I am at fault for each death upon the cursed plain of Dusker. You keep saying it's your fault, father, but you're wrong. His Highness doesn't blame you. Neither does King Lambert, I'm sure of it. But I guess that's not the issue for you, is it? It was my duty to protect the royal family. I should have given my life to protect the king. Even if his highness has forgiven me, my knightly vows are still broken. My knighthood is lost. That's obvious from looking at you, father. I think mother understood it as well. But before fleeing the country, I wish you had thought about your family. If only for a moment. Even if the whole world had condemned you. We would always have been your allies. I am sorry, Annette. No, I told you before. I don't particularly want you to apologize. Annette. Yes, father? Take this. A bundle of letters? There are so many. Look inside and you will understand. Should the contents make you sad, please burn them. Father! For the love of... He's done it again! 
<sighs> but what have we here? <laughs> Just as I thought. Letters for me and mother. So many. But why? And how? <sighs> I suppose I'll have to read them if I hope to find my answers. <coughs> el nivel de puente de Reddick lo subió. Flame y Manuela. Hola, profesor Manuela. I wish you to know that I have heard ever so much about your talents. <laughs> Whatever are you talking about, Flame? Singing. Why, you are you are wonderfully skilled at it, are you not? Why? I have even overheard people saying your voice is akin to the singing of a goddess. It makes me happy to hear. But who told you that? Oh, the students are always speaking of it, which got me to thinking. Estudiantes. Ah. I may be the only person in all of the academy who's never heard your beautiful voice in song. So, I was wondering, Manuela, might you sing a little something for me? Your request is touching, but I can't perform on such short notice. My voice is an instrument and requires proper gentle care. However, the stories are true. I was once the leader of the Middle Franc troupe, but that was a long time ago. Middle Franc? Um, what do those words mean precisely? You've never heard of the Middle Franc troupe? Before the war, it was the single most popular opera company in the Imperial capital. I used to sing on stage with them. I was the star, in fact. Oh, wow! In all of Enbar? They must not have been around when I was living there. You used to live in Enbar? Indeed. Although I was quite a bit younger at the time. It is where I was born, as a matter of fact. Oh, well, you must have been too young to hear about us. Ah, uh, yes, <laughs> that could be. And what precisely is the function of an opera troupe? You don't know what an opera troupe is? It's a group of performers like myself who act out stories on stage in front of a big audience. Stories with lots of singing. I understand now. I certainly have experience in the fine art of storytelling. Debo decir, con el lenguaje que utiliza Flane, hay partes en las que puedo entender lo que está diciendo, pero leo el texto y no sé qué está diciendo. Azaz, experiencia, tengo en el noble arte de contar historias. ¿Qué significa Azaz? There is often singing as a part of story time for the children at the monastery. That is darling, Flame. But I'm not sure it's quite the same thing as an opera. You see, operas are performed in grand theaters with orchestral accompaniment. Everyone attending wears their finest. It is a very special occasion. Theaters, they're called? You mean to say that there are buildings exclusively used for telling stories? Yep. You Never even heard of a theater? You're an intelligent <coughs> girl, Flame, and the world is full of wonders. You have a lot left to discover. Ese ha sido bonito. Esta pues ha sido bonito. Manuela con Gilbert. Is that singing? Glimmers in the dark, the red canyon calls. Goddess, reach in dreams, to her throne she falls. Well, Gilbert, what do you think? My lady, you were not meant to notice me. <laughs> you were not meant to notice me. Man like you. My apologies for interrupting. Please excuse me. 
No, Gilbert, hold on a moment. You're not disturbing me, truly. I want very much to know what you thought of my singing. The least you can do is tell me. You were lovely. You sounded lovely. Lovely? Is that what you really feel? Please, be honest. Why would you suppose I was dishonest? That is not the look of someone who just heard what they deemed to be lovely. It hurts my confidence when my voice can't even lure a fleeting smile to your face. It's as though my singing voice has died since stepping off the middle franc stage. My Lady Manuela, that could be no further from the truth. If that's the case, then Gilbert, I challenge you to a duel! My singing versus your Iron Mask. I will break through, and I will see passion in your eyes. Why did she leave so suddenly? And what could she have meant by a duel? Something is surely troubling her. <coughs> Bueno, eso ha sido todo por el Let's Play Fire Emblem 3 Houses. Cuando vuelva del médico, haremos esta batalla. Espero que lo estéis disfrutando. <coughs> y hasta la próxima.